What's up guys, it's your girl that's the Jasmine back on the cam. If you are new to my channel, welcome. So today guys, I'm going to be doing a unboxing plus install video. I ordered this wig from Amazon. It was 150% density and it was 18 inch wig for only $80 guys. I was so shook. So right here, I'm just showing you guys the packaging, and I'm going to be opening that. So what came in the package is a weaving cap and also a, I guess you could say, pamphlet of the different wigs they had on the site. And they also gave me some lashes. And now for the fun part, the wig. So I'm just gonna take it right out of the package and I'm gonna take that little net off as well. And I'm just gonna show you guys how it's looking right out of the packaging. It was very soft, very flowy. I was actually kind of surprised. And guys, when I comb my fingers through the wig, I literally only got like five strands of hair. So that was a really good sign. And I'm just showing you guys how the hairline is looking. The hairline was actually looking pretty okay of course it needed some work done the knots needed to be bleach and it needed to be plugged but for the most part it was actually really nice and also guys the hair was actually true to its length it was actually 18 inches and I went ahead and bleached the knots and it came out really nice and after I bleached the knots the hair rarely shed at all So after bleaching the knots, I of course and went ahead and washed the wig and now I'm just brushing through the hair and showing you guys how much shedding I got. So I ended up plucking the wig and I forgot to show you guys how much hair shed from the wig but it was literally a handful. So next it is time to install this wig. I'm going to be using Got To Be Glued Spray and spraying that all on my hairline. And then after that I'm going to go in with my blow dryer. And if you guys are wondering what I'm looking at, I'm actually looking at my TV because I was just really bored. And after that, I'm going to go in with my 91% alcohol and put that on a face pad and wipe it all over my forehead. Next, I'm going to be putting on a nude cap and going on my James Charles palette and going in with that medium dark brown and putting that all over the cap on my head. And then going in again with that Got To Be Glued spray and spraying it all over my hairline. And now on both sides, I'm just going to poke a little hole where my ears are. And now all I'm doing is going in with my blow dryer and just making sure that Got To Be Glued Spray is dry. And now it is time to cut the cap off.
And once I'm done with that, I'm gonna go back in with my 91% alcohol and clean my forehead off. And the glue I'm gonna be using is Bold Hold Adhesive and I'm gonna put that all over the cap. This is gonna help me glue my cap down. And I'm gonna be using a popsicle stick to help me evenly smear that out all over. And once I am done gluing the cap down, I'm going to go ahead and measure the wig on my head. And we're going to go right back in with that bowl hold and popsicle stick again to help us glue our wig down. And again, I'm just using this popsicle stick to just evenly smear out this glue so that it won't be white or anything. So the way I like to apply my glue is in sections. I like to apply it on the top part of my forehead and then the right side and then the left side. So while the top part of my head is drying with the glue on, I go on the right side and when the right side has glue on it, I let that dry while I go on the left side. So I go on these three different sections when I apply my glue and I use three coats of glue. So guys, I realized that my phone stopped recording when I put my wig on. So you guys didn't see that part and I'm so sorry for that. But the wig is now on and you guys see me cutting the lace and the way I'm doing it is kind of in a zigzag motion. Um, I do that because I don't want it to be kind of noticeable where the lace starts. So right here I am just cutting off that ear tab and I noticed the lace was a little bit lifting in some spaces so all I did was just go back in with some boho glue and apply that where it was needed. And I'm going to be using a rat tail comb to help me lay down that little piece of lace that was lifting.
So I know you guys see it's looking a little white, so I'm going to go back in with that James Charles palette and that medium dark brown color and just put that all over the lace. And today guys, we're going to be doing a middle part, so I'm just going to get a comb and part my hair down the middle. And we're going to just do some edges and whatnot. I'm going to cut these with a little razor. And to do my edges, I'm going to be using Got To Be Glue Styling Gel. And after that, I just put this white elastic band over my forehead to keep my edges laid. And I'm going to be using that hair polisher serum I just showed you guys and put that all over my hair to make it soft and smooth. And we're going to be using She Is Bomb Collection Wax Stick. And I'm going to be going in sections, putting this all over the hair and using my hot comb to flatten that out because we want this to be a flat middle part guys we don't want this looking lumpy and grumpy we want this to be laid and slayed okay and right now i'm just flat ironing a section of my hair and once we're done with the bottom section we're gonna go in with the top section and go in that same she is bomb wax stick and put that all over the top of our head and then we're going to use a hot comb again to flatten that all out Guys, this wig is looking way too good for just $80. Like, I am shook right now. So, I'm just going to take that elastic band off and see how it's looking. And she is looking lay and slay, hunty. Okay. If you made it this far, thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate you guys. Thank you for tuning in. I'm going to snap my fingers and we're done. Thank you so much, guys, for watching this video. Make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. And I can't wait to see you guys in the next one. Bye.